Spikey and Bubbles were looking at the stars when Spikey, as usual, raised some interesting questions. Twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder what you are. Hey, Bubbles, have you ever wondered why some stars are brighter than others? Why are these stars of different colors? Also, how far exactly are they from the Earth? And imagine we have a spaceship that travels at the speed of light. How long would it take us to reach the nearest star? Good questions. But let's start with the simplest question. What is a star? A star is a huge ball of burning gases which emits energy in the form of heat and light. Our sun is a star. These huge balls of dust and gas come in different colors and brightness levels. They are also located at different distances from the Earth. Let's first discuss the colors of stars. The color of a star depends on its size and temperature. Stars emit heat and light in different amounts. The coolest and the smallest stars appear red. The hottest and the most massive stars appear blue. The stars in between these two extremes are orange, yellow, and white in color. Our sun is a yellow star. What is its size and temperature? Pause the video and discuss. The sun is a medium-sized star with a temperature between two extremes. Now let's discuss brightness. Look at these street lamps. The lamp further away appears dimmer than the one closer to us, even though they both emit the same amount of light. It's the same with stars. Imagine two stars that emit the same amount of energy. One is near the Earth, and the other is further away. Which one will look brighter? The one closer to the Earth. Excellent! Now imagine looking at two stars that are the same distance from the Earth. The star which emits more energy will appear brighter. Thus, the brightness of a star depends on the distance of the star from the Earth and the amount of energy it emits. Let's answer Spikey's last question. How far are these stars from the Earth? To put it simply, stars are very, very far away from us. The Sun is about 150 million kilometers away from the Earth. Distances between stars are so great that kilometers are no longer useful as units. Instead, astronomers use light years to measure distances in the universe. A light year is a measure of distance that light covers in one year at the speed of 300,000 kilometers per second. To get a sense of how huge this is, one light year is equal to 9.5 trillion kilometers. The moon is just one light second away from the Earth. This means that the light of the moon takes one second to reach the Earth. The sun, our closest star, is eight light minutes away from the Earth. The next closest star, Proxima Centauri, is 4.2 light years away from us. Now, Spikey, if you had a spaceship that traveled at the speed of light, how long would it take you to reach Proxima Centauri? 4.2 years, because Proxima Centauri is 4.2 light years away. Twinkle, twinkle, little star, now I know exactly what you are. Yay! Let's summarize. A star is a huge ball of burning gases which emits energy in the form of heat and light. The color of a star depends on its size and temperature. The brightness of a star 
depends on its distance from the Earth and the amount of energy it emits. Star distances are measured in light years. A light year is the distance that light covers in one year at the speed of 300,000 kilometers per second.